Hey what's up you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, hello, I'm Lydia and if you are new here make sure you hit the subscribe button, join the growing family, turn notifications on so you don't miss an upload and while you're down there give me a thumbs up because it really does help me out. Today I'm going to be talking about why I take clonazepam. So I've been on clonazepam for about five years now and it's been one of the most beneficial drugs that I take. Now at times I've been on the highest dose and time, other times I've been on the lowest dose. I'm currently on the lowest dose which is 0 0.5 milligrams. I take that twice a day. Once in the afternoon and then once at night. And I find that works very well for me. Now. I take Nazapam because of my anxiety. My anxiety is pretty bad. It gets to a point where I physically can't breathe if I don't take Nazapam. If I don't take something for my anxiety, I have panic attacks and they are horrific. It gets to a point where I can't breathe. I think I'm having a breakdown and it just, it sucks. I used to have panic attacks all the time and my doctor wouldn't prescribe anything for me and it took for me to make an attempt on my life after having a panic attack because I thought it was so bad I didn't want to live. So I, I took an overdose and when I got asked why I did it I said panic attack and that was when an uncle doctor made the decision to prescribe me diazepam. Now I was on diazepam for about a year. It didn't do much for me. Then I was put onto lorazepam, which does work for me. Kind of. It sends me to sleep. So there's that. Then I was put onto a combination of clonazepam and lorazepam. I was on that combination for two years and to this day that was probably the best combination of medications for my anxiety. Currently I have clonazepam 0.5mg twice a day and I have lorazepam 2mg PRN which is take when needed. So. It does very much so depend on how I'm feeling. I don't use lorazepam very often. When I was at uni and going into lectures, I had to take lorazepam with me because I got too anxious being around people and any time their presentation or speaking in front of a class came up, I left early because I just can't do it. I've never done a presentation in front of people because of, because of my anxiety. The one time I in secondary school, or high school as Americans say, I got asked to speak about, I had to write a character profile with emotions and the character I was doing was really anxious and sad so when I was crying and shaking it looked like good, looked like good acting. And I got an A star on that, so anxiety is just some good, I guess. But honestly, clonazepam has been a life saving medication for me. I've been on beta blockers. I still take bisoprolol because of my pots. I take bisoprolol. I used to take propanolol, but I overdosed on it and it stopped prescribing it typical me story. If anyone was to ask me how many times I've overdosed, I, I don't think I could give a number because of I've done I've tried to kill myself so many times that it just isn't it's, it's not something I've kept track of. But yeah, clonazepam helps a lot with my anxiety. I still struggle with my anxiety at times and 
yes, I probably do need to increase the doses of methamazepam, but I don't want to do anything that could risk getting stopped. So I'm still coping on the lowest dose and I'm not asking for an increase because it does work. I just get overwhelmed with my autism a lot of the time and it feels like the only option I have is to cry and use lorazepam which yes I do have lorazepam to take but I don't want to rely on it because then if I need more they're going to stop prescribing it because they'll think I'm just abusing the drug which I'm not so yeah that's a little video talking a bit about why I use clonazepam, how it helps, what doses I've been on, how long I've been on it, and I hope it, it gives you some insight. Thank you for watching and if you are new, subscribe. I will leave a link to my medication playlist on the iCard up there. So if you want to see other medication related videos, they'll be there. Thank you for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Peace.